So Doctor Doom coming to the MCU is a very exciting prospect. Obviously, everyone wants to see Doctor Doom as a big villain in the MCU, and obviously with the multiverse coming very soon, Secret Wars did actually start in the comics from Doctor Doom. And in today's video, I'm going to go over some exciting news, potential news that we got yesterday, uh, at the fact that you know Doctor Doom could be getting his own MCU project, and it could be very, very soon. So yesterday we got some big news and some very exciting news from a big star in, in the world and his name is obviously Howard Stern and most people know him, he'd be very famous, big, he has his own podcast, he you know talks to a lot of people on it and you know um, he did, well like I said what I'm going to go over in this video about Doctor Doom, he did say a lot about uh, Doctor Doom and in, in, in his podcast he said that he's going to do a Doctor Doom during a commercial break where he obviously forgot to mute his mic microphone and uh yeah that's that's obviously very very confusing to us so um i'm gonna go over it so if you do enjoy this video please like subscribe and uh yeah let's just get into the video so obviously howard stern big star in hollywood and a very big star just all around and you know he he is a i don't think he will be playing dr doom don't worry i do not think dr dr doom is going to be played by howard stern I do think that he obviously will be making an appearance in in the um, in the show or movie, sorry, whatever it may be, um, whatever this Doctor Doom project may be. We we don't have any confirmation on what it, it's going to be yet. Um, but I do not think Howard Stern will play Doctor Doom. I think that wouldn't be very good. I think a, a casting like Brian Cranston or Cillian Murphy, someone like them, them sort of actors, I think they could definitely play the role of Doctor Doom. I think they'd be them two are definitely good. Uh, options for Doctor Doom, but obviously there's so many more actors out there that could probably play the Doctor Doom role as well. But those two, I think, could play it t t really well. And I think they both would be a good casting, either one of them or anyone else, like I said. And uh, in in his podcast on the commercial break, he um, told uh, obviously Kevin Feige how it works, and he was saying, "But they're going over the schedule with me, and it's going to suck." So obviously he talks about what he's been told about you know MCU projects and the the you know the time schedules and stuff like that for uh, filming and stuff like that. Um, I don't think Howard Stern, like I said before, he's not going to be Doctor Doom. I do. I think he's going to maybe play a big role in this in this show or project, whatever this this thing is going to be. I, we have no clue what it is going to be yet. Obviously, we knew Doctor Doom was coming to the MCU very soon, and I think uh, we've had hints from. Um, recently actually in Moon Knight you know he um where Moon Knight la landed in the first episode he was actually outside uh, the castle of Victor Von Doom and on the, the the trucks there was Von Doom written on the back as well I think that wasn't a direct I don't think it was a direct hit direct towards um obviously Doctor Doom but obviously I think it is a big hint towards him coming to the MCU very soon and it is being reported that Doctor Doom will make an appearance or Victor Von Doom will make an appearance in um Black Panther Wakanda forever and obviously that would make a lot of sense with all you know Wakanda going against um, Liberia um, countries that you know Doctor Doom is going to be a part of and it, it, Doctor Doom is a very fascinating villain you know you know he does he is the puppet maker of he is a puppeteer of you know Secret Wars in the comics he does start it all off and um, yeah he is a big he is a big um villain in the comics and obviously it would be a waste of potential not bringing Doctor Doom into the MCU and with the Fantastic Four project that got announced you know 2019 you know Doctor Doom is a big Fantastic Four villain and I do think Doctor Doom is going to be just a big be a big villain of the MCU all around but with the Fantastic Four coming soon I think they could all you know bring him in uh, in Black Panther Wakanda Forever give him his own project and then he'll come into Fantastic Four but obviously he won't die in that I think he'll be a like a small villain because you know they're probably going to save him for Secret Wars with Kang as well. You know there's so many villains that are going to be coming to the MCU, and Del Doctor Doom is definitely one of them. You know he is very powerful, very cool villain. Everyone wants to see him, and uh, yeah, this news is pretty big. I just wanted to go over this. Um, you know, he I've like I said before for the third time, it's not going to be Howard Stern that's going to be playing uh, Doctor Doom in the MCU, but I think he will. I think he will obviously have a big role in the project, whatever this may be. But I don't think this is him saying, oh yeah, I'm going to be playing Doctor Doom in the MCU. I think he's been, he's saying this about the project that he's going to, you know, the, the thing he's going to be in. He did directly say about a Doctor Doom project in the um, commercial break as well. But, you know, Michael Fassbender, you know, he played Magneto 
that would be a pretty cool one to see if he doesn't play Magneto in the MCU. Cillian Murphy, like I said, you know, there's so many actors that could play um, Doctor Doom and I think it'll be a waste making, you know, Howard Stern. I'm not saying he's a bad actor, he hasn't been in acting for years now. And I think that, you know, putting him straight into Doctor Doom wouldn't be the best of ideas when there's so many more actors that they could get to play Doctor Doom. I'm not saying he's a bad actor, I didn't say, I'm not saying that, but I think there are more actors out there like Michael Fassbender or Cillian Murphy or, you know, Bri Brian Cranston. There are so many more people that are out there that they could get to play this character and I don't think it's going to be Howard Stern, you know. But, he's get, but this is big news for us Marvel fans because we've been wanting Doctor Doom in the MCU for a very long time now. Obviously, we know he's probably going to be in Wakanda Forever this year. But I think him getting his own project as well, I think that's going to be that's going to be very cool to see. Obviously, he does say he's going to do Doctor Doom. That's what he said in the, the podcast at the um, at the break. But that does not necessarily mean he's going to be playing Doctor Doom the role. Like that's him just saying that could mean anything you know in the project or he's a part of the, the like the team making the project whatever it may be he could that could be anything and I, I highly doubt he they're gonna make pick him to play Doctor Doom in the MCU because like I said there's so many more people out there that could play the role of Doctor Doom rather than Howard Stern and they could give Howard Stern a more little role you know I don't think they're gonna want I don't think Howard Stern's gonna want to stay in the MCU forever forever how long they they want to keep Doctor Doom in the MCU because Doctor Doom's gonna be a character that they want to keep in the MCU for a, for a, a very long time it's gonna be a villain that's gonna be developed on on and it's gonna be a villain that's gonna stay for a very long time and I don't think Howard Stern's gonna want to do that so yeah tell me how you feel about this news I think it's massive news for us Marvel fans because you know not only is are we going to see him in Wakanda forever and probably Fantastic Four movie but also we're going to be seeing him in um his own project obviously in Multiverse of Madness when Reed Richards used the portal that was designed by Doctor Doom in the comics so maybe that's a direct reference to that as well but yeah tell me what you think about this from Howard Stern I think it's big news but yeah tell me how you feel about this I uh, hope you enjoyed the video today and I'll see you in the next one